This is an Algebra 1 sample question number 4. So for this question it says which expression is equivalent to and we have 3x to the fifth power plus 8x um, to the third power minus 7x squared minus 6x to the third power. So for my first step what I'm going to do is I'm just going to write it just the way I see it with the parentheses to see what's going on. So exactly the way I see it. Second step, I'm going to analyze it. If there's no number in front of here to distribute, you are mistaken, there's actually a positive one. So if it looks like there's nothing, it's secretly a positive one. And one times anything is the other number. That means nothing will change here because one times three X to the fifth power is three X to the fifth power. One times eight X cubed is still positive eight X cubed. All right, but on the other side, there is something you have to worry about. If there is a minus and no number, it's secretly a negative one. So there is a negative one that you are gonna have to distribute. That is how you're gonna get those numbers away from those parentheses. So negative one times anything, all it does is changes the sign. So negative times positive is negative. Notice that seven X squared stayed the same value, but now it's just negative. Negative one times negative six X to the third power just becomes positive six X to the third power. Now from here, we're gonna see if there's any um, terms to be combined. And I see that we have x to the third power and another x to the third power. Those are the ones I can combine. So from here, if you were to combine those yellows, you have 8x cubed plus 6x cubed. That is the same thing as 14x cubed. I did put that directly in the middle because you have to look for your highest degree. So this five represents your highest degree which means it does have to be mentioned first when you're writing this in standard form. Standard form is when you're going in decreasing order in terms of degree. So this has to be here, three X to the fifth power. And the other person that didn't have a partner was negative seven X to the second power. If you don't know what I mean by degree, I am gonna make you look right here, we have five and then a three and then a two. So that's what I mean by descending order of degree. You just gotta put the highest degree with the X value, sorry, the highest degree of the value of the exponent of the X and that's how you would write it. So I have X to the fifth power, X to the third power, X to the second power. And so this answer matches C and that is your answer.